Jank to Max, welcome to a new episode of Game Shred. Tonight we're cooking some ribeye steak with Nutella. I haven't seen this recipe anywhere in the world. I don't think anyone ever tried it except for me and my friends. And it turned out to be Jank to Mang. So if you guys try it. <laughs> so guys, we're gonna try it. We're gonna make make ourselves a grilled ribeye steak with a Nutella vinaigrette or dressing or sauce or whatever. And it's gonna be fantastic. It's sweet, it's savory, it's spicy because we got a lot of herbs. So now I'm gonna show you how we're gonna season this bad boy and grill it. All right guys, so here's what we need for this recipe. Of course, a nice thick cut of ribeye steak with good marbling. This has decent marbling, a lot of fat slobs. I like fat slobs, got a lot of fat slobs. And jank the mangs in the steak, which is good. Gonna be juicy. We need some Worcestershire sauce. This is, if you want to use it, if you like it, I'm just gonna use that as a base for my dressing to stick on it, for my seasoning. We're gonna use some pepper flakes because we want it spicy. We need some olive oil, Nutella, of course. I love this sh It's brown, but it's not sh Some black pepper, some regular white salt, a roast rub if you need it, if you want it, it's optional, and red chili powder. It's really spicy. It's gonna be sweet and spicy, savory and spicy. I mean sweet and savory and spicy. Okay, guys, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take this beautiful Worcestershire, Worcestershire sauce, if you wanna pronounce it. You're gonna doze it, yeah, oh yeah, get in there, get in there. And you wanna, you wanna massage it, you wanna massage it. This is a nice piece of meat, so you wanna massage it with your finger, get, all, get, get it between the holes, man, get it. Go for it, all right. Do the same one on the side, you wanna hold it with the place, you guys stop staring at me right now, so it's kind of weird now. Just try to cook here. Ain't nothing wrong with massaging your piece of meat. The cow is a blessing, it was alive at some point, so you wanna treat it well. You wanna treat it well, all right guys. All right guys, next up, Salt and pepper. Everyone needs them, we need them. All right guys, we need some regular salt. If you want it to be salty, salt gives it nice flavor. Be generous, this is a big cut of meat. You know, we got a lot of holes. This should be enough, do the same on the other side. Deal. And now what you want to do is, Black pepper, be generous with it. You want to taste it. I, I personally like black, I don't, I'm not a big fan of black pepper, but on steak, I freaking love it. So, we're gonna add that, that's a lot of good flavor. Now you want to go with the uh, roast, actually we're gonna leave this to the end, because it's kind of big. We're gonna go with the uh, chili powder. The chili powder is very spicy. It's a nice, cool, spicy flavor, so, we're not gonna keep it off, but we're gonna keep it dry as well. All right, a little bit of this uh, roast rub. Now this is not a roast, we're grilling it. This has a nice flavor, so we're gonna add a little bit. It has some chili flakes, we want it to be spicy. Chili flakes is gonna get a really good spicy. All right guys, we're gonna do the same on the other side, and it's gonna be set, we're gonna go to our sauce. So right now we're gonna do the uh, Nutella marination. This is very simple, very easy. All you need is some olive oil to make it more liquefied. Actually, we need to put the Nutella first, and make it bad. So we're gonna open this bad boy. Mm. All right, take a healthy amount of Nutella. Dump it in. Don't be shy, Nutella's good. And I got hazelnuts, apparently it gives you cancer because that's what the news I've been saying right now. You know? All right, we got the Nutella in there. Don't drop your spoon. And now just add some more olive oil. This is very, this is a very unhealthy meal. Because you got oil, you got red meat, you got barbecue, smoke is not that healthy, so yeah. All right, you want to mix it, incorporate it well with the oil. Get it liquidy, viscous, kind of viscous, liquidy. Viscous, viscous, yeah, we got a position right here, so we're gonna make, turn it. We're gonna make the viscosity really thin. Yeah! That's how we gonna do, that's how we gonna do. All right guys, this might be good. We might need to add a little bit more olive oil. Taste good with the oil. Add a little bit more oil, mix it in. Now the oil is gonna work well with the meat, it's gonna let the fire flare up. So we wanna make sure that our fire isn't too hot, because it has a lot of oil. This chocolate thing has a lot of oil. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a beautiful cut of steak. You might wanna come closer. Because right now it's gonna splat. Yeah, it's splat. We're gonna keep it in, we're gonna flip it again. We're gonna make sure it's fully coated with Nutella. This might be excessive, we're gonna remove some of the Nutella later on. But right now, we're just gonna keep it in this mixture. Let the Nutella work its way with the meat. We're gonna wait for five minutes. You can keep it longer if you want the flavor to be more intense. We're gonna keep it here for five minutes, go out to the grill, and grill this bad boy. We're gonna eat it up! Are 
Alright guys, so it is such a beautiful day over here. It is such a jank to mang of a day. I guess you're wondering what that is. But right now, sitting by the pool, we're gonna barbecue this and the table. We're gonna see how it goes. I'm looking back because I don't fall in the pool. Right here we got medium heat, not too hot, not too not hot. That makes sense. We've got the coals only on one side. We're gonna keep this direct heat on. But if we feel like the fire is too hot, we're gonna move it to the indirect side with the coals. We got a Nutella baby over here. This time the grill is bad boy. All right guys, so we don't need to lube up this grill. This has enough oil in it that Donald Trump is gonna go crazy on this bad boy. Let's get a closer shot. Take a look at this. Guys, just a heads up, this is not poo, this is Nutella. This is gonna be good. And you know, it might be excessive, it might not be, we're about to find out. We're gonna keep it on the grill and we're gonna see how this bad boy reacts. You might wanna come closer right now, man. You guys ready? We're gonna slap this bad boy on. That's what we want to see, and you guys can see that the fire is flaring up because of the oil in it. So this is really good. We're going to move it off to the side real quick, real quick, but we're going to let it set right now for a little bit, build that crust on it. We're going to cook it on each side for two and a half minutes. So uh, it's 522, we got to wear it a little bit. Two and a half minutes, so it's going to give us a nice caramelization, but it's not going to be well done inside because who, who, who freaking eats well done steak? That's not how you eat steak. All right guys, so right now it's been a good minute. Grilling over here, we can see the nice crust, the nice caramelization. We're still gonna cook it for more on this side, but we wanna build the crust on the other side. And then we're kinda gonna move it to the opposite direction. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Ooh wee! Yes, me, that's a good ribeye steak right here. That's a good ribeye steak, check this out guys, check this out. Yeah, you only learn this if you gotta make the Nutella steak. You don't know how to make a Nutella steak. You shouldn't know how to make. Oh shit. You shouldn't know how to do this. Yeah. yeah. All right, we can see a nice caramelization. We're gonna move it 90 degrees. I don't know how many degrees that was because I wasn't paying attention. Just to get the nice marks on it. And now we're gonna close the lid off. Let it cook for two minutes on each side. Two minutes on each side, not more. We want this. I don't know what my friends how they like your steak, but I personally like it rare. We're gonna cook it medium, medium rare, so they can eat as well. And it's gonna be a good one. It's beautiful, it's beautiful. All right, ladies and gentlemen, close the lid on. Keep the damper open right above the steak. You got that good oxygen, ox, 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 oxidizing. So you can get oxygen inside over the steak. And now we wait. We wait for two minutes. And it's gonna be good. It's gonna be ready. We're gonna eat it. It's 525, 527. We're pulling this bad boy up. We're gonna put some more Nutella on top as a garnish or sauce or whatever. And we're gonna eat this bad boy. All right, guys, we're gonna flip the steak one last time. Leave it for a minute. One minute left. And this is gonna be nice, medium, rare, or rare. Just how I like it and the feel of it. You can't taste the Nutella right now a lot. That's why we're gonna add some more later on on top of it. But trust me guys, this will be a fantastic steak that you guys will only try once in a lifetime if... What am I saying? <laughs> this is gonna be a fantastic steak because not a lot of people know this recipe. Not a lot of people accept the fact that you're gonna put chocolate with a steak. But trust me guys, this is fantastic. And you, you, you guys can also add a... Uh... <laughs> okay. All right, you guys can also add uh, coffee grounds to the seasoning. It's gonna give it a nice bitterness that can go with the chocolate really well, but I done it today. Not a big fan of coffee. But yeah, guys, as you guys can see, the steak is kind of ready. This is how the, I like the caramelization. I'm gonna pull it off right now, add some Nutella on it, and we're gonna chop into this bad boy. This is gonna suck. All right, guys, we're not gonna cut into the steak right now. We're gonna actually let it rest for five minutes. But before we let it rest, we, got, we gotta show some love. We gotta show some love. Take a little bit of Nutella. Spread it on that. The steak is hot. It's gonna take the Nutella well. It's gonna complement it well. It's gonna melt on it. And it's gonna be good. All right, guys, that is it for the Nutella right now. We're gonna let the steak rest for five minutes, we're gonna cut into it, we're gonna see it, we're gonna eat it, and we're gonna tell you what the others think, because we got a guy that's not a big fan of such kind of meat, with Nutella, actually no one is, but we're gonna let him try it. One guy's gonna like it for sure, we're gonna see what the others think. Yeah. 
All right, guys, so the steak has been resting. We're gonna cut into it right now. We're gonna take a look inside. And let's see, I actually forgot which side the grain is going and I can't really see. I think the grain's going this way, so we're gonna cut it this way. We always cut against the grain. I'm not sure if this knife is sharp enough. I don't think it is. All right, guys, this is a moment of truth. I'm gonna take one, we're gonna see how it tastes like. Look at that. Look at that, ain't that a beauty? Ain't that a beauty? Let's put that kit. This is actually pretty good. This is actually fantastic. I love this freaking recipe. I love this recipe. Mmm! Guys, we're gonna go inside. We're gonna let our friends try it. We're gonna see what they think. I guess try this goddamn steak! I've got a bit of fun. It is a nice combination though. It's, uh, <laughs> it's good, it's good. Shakes <laughs> off, man. Not at all. Mm. I like. Ah, oh, he's going for seconds. Going for seconds. Going for seconds, guys. What do you think, man? What do you think? It's not. I'm going to be honest. Here. It's not amazing, but it's good. It's not All right, bad. now not bad. try the piece with a lot of Nutella. All right, guys, this piece has a lot of Nutella. Eat it. This sound bitch tastes good. <laughs> yeah! It tastes good. It's better than the Lesser Nutella steak part. I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. No, thank a you. thumbs up. So this guy do. gives it two thumbs down. What about this guy? I like it, man. It's good. How much? How much thumbs? Oh, yes, sir. What do you rate it? No, no, no. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. What do you rate it? <laughs> no one gives a damn! Man, what do you rate it? Four thumbs up, baby. Yeah, 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 four thumbs up. So we do. All right, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna add some more Nutella and eat it. Eat <laughs> it. <laughs> I always Man, tell you guys, done. this guy with a knife is always up to no good. <laughs> what the? Fuck? Yeah, I'm gonna finish right with that. Man, the tiller's still good. <laughs> <laughs> this is the uh, final review of the steak. Okay. All right, guys, he dropped the steak, and then he went to take a shit in the toilet. He went to take a dump, but he missed. Now this is Nutella. <laughs> we added some more Nutella and now I'm gonna enjoy it. Nutella stick. Mmm. Yeah. 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 Now for those of you who uh, never know whether you want to eat some sweet, some savory, you get from Nutella stick. It's savory and sweet at the same time. I mean, it's called the main course and the dessert at the same time, you know? Yeah, y'all don't want anything else. Y'all don't want anything else. This guy can't get enough. It's really good. Gotta be honest with you. Gotta be 100% honest. It's pretty good. All right, so guys, that is it for tonight's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Now this recipe, let me just get into this room. I can't, it's too bright, too bright. All right, now this recipe is not for everyone once again, but I just want to tell you guys that it is actually pretty freaking fantastic. It, it, it's actually savory and sweet at the same time. So if you guys are into that kind of stuff, and if you guys like steaks, please do check out this recipe. It is going to be nice. Trust me, guys, like one of my friends didn't like it. The rest of the guys liked it. 
<laughs> but yeah, guys, that is it for today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys didn't make sure to give a like, share, and subscribe, like, like, peace, guys, peace. And this is what happens. While we're going in, I don't care if you kill me. I'm gonna look at the camera because I need to explain this. What, 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 what are you guys playing? Man, I'm playing this gay ass game, man. What's it called? It's called uh, Dungeons and Dragons. What a bunch of weeboos. There's too much weeb in that. <laughs> <laughs>